Shortly after 11 o'clock, the van arrived, carrying six tons of the Colombian marijuana. We went before the court and got a court order to destroy it. Last night, the judge called and stayed the order until 12 o'clock today to give the defense a chance to take samples. At this time, they'll take samples from each bale to determine and, and give to the independent uh, examiner or toxicologist to determine if, in fact, what is being burned here today is marijuana and what their clients possess was, in fact, marijuana. It took 45 minutes to unload all the bales of grass. Samples were taken by both defense lawyers and state officers. The pile stood almost six feet high and 15 feet across, six tons of Colombian marijuana. A few people gathered to watch, downwind. The high-grade grass was drenched with kerosene and diesel fuel. Then a member of the Baldwin County Grand Jury threw a lighted flare, and it all went up in flames. For those of us who will never see a million, there goes three and a half million up in smoke and the end of another smuggling operation. Rob Jennings, Channel 10 Newspeak.